Welcome to the Contemporary Art Modern Project. We're just exhibiting here at Scope 2021 in North uh, in Miami Beach, and we just wanted to kind of give a little introduction as to the booth and the artists that we've been working with. So right here we have our kind of premier African artist, Idris Habib. He's been working in these large scale acrylics and waxes to kind of paint onto these African fabrics that he's been sourcing and been working with kind of over the years. This is just his most recent collection for 2021. And we've just been really proud of being able to work with him and finally show off the African artists that we've been able to host since February. Um, amongst them, not only Idris are we showing, but actually inside the booth, we have the other Ghana-based artist, Musa Swala, across this wall. and what he's kind of been doing with contemporary fashion and especially kind of the black male gaze and his focus upon so much of what African art is now. It's not just the classical, it's not just the Aborigine. Contemporary artists are really pushing forward with so much of their work. And we have it really contrasting against Cuban-American artist Carlos Gamez de Francisco, that he's been, as opposed to the contemporary fashion, we're working with extremely classical in these contrasting modern sunglass kind of approach with his very classical based acrylic on canvas portraiture and we're even jumping further kind of across the world as we kind of go on and on into Dominic Schmidt's kind of abstract portraiture in which he's focusing heavily on this layering of memories upon each other even going as far as how the paint is applied the mixed media that he's using within newspaper clippings and magazines, layered upon layered, that each memory kind of unfolds underneath. But in our small little corner of the booth, we have a Brazilian artist as well, Rosana Machado Rodriguez, where she's been applying kind of this photography to fiber-based pieces in this new adaptation of media as she embarks on a reflection of not only kind of her inner self and her memories within these last couple years, but a reflection on to her kind of almost uncomfortable nature that she has within her own body, where she's regressing into this kind of uh, flat stance and wants you to really feel how she's been portraying herself within her own photograph work but our booth still doesn't end there. We're showing artists from all across the world. And so yet we once again jump to Italian artist, Elena Monzo, and her atypical portraiture once again. So much of our booth is based upon this contrasting ideals of how portraiture is handled in the current environment between how fashion is handled, how the age demographic is handled, even how gender is handled within portraiture and the kind of variations that are applying to each and every single one of the artists. And from paintings, we kind of step into traditional photograph work instead with Sonia Ravel and Quif Latina, nor, uh, local to Miami, a photographer and drag queen duo that we've been representing for a while and are once again taking that different approach to portraiture where they're heavily relying on this call to a different age where the struggle of the housewife is kind of exhumed to the modern stance. And our few video works that we're presenting as part of an exhibition, a small exhibit that we're showing in North Miami, Bego Santiago, a Spanish artist, where she's able to replicate these videos, these intense memories that she's been having in each an individual kind of frame where the characters expand and her self-portraits reveal themselves more and more, exposing herself to a kind of general public. But there's still one last artist that we can't forget. We make the full rounds from the rest of the Western portraiture to now, once again, an African ideal. And our last African artist, Moses Zabor from Nigeria, and his now re-emphasis upon this male, uh, this black male modern kind of attitude where we need to kind of struggle past all the previous acclamations that society has gotten used to and bring each other up instead of always pointing towards the negative. We need to become a society once again 
where everyone is upon equal and we can all base each other and kind of ourselves within the uplifting news of each other. But that's a little tour of our booth at Scope 2021, booth D11, and we're the Contemporary Art Modern Project, also known as the Camp Gallery. You can always find us at, at the Camp Gallery on our Instagram, or you can always visit thecampgallery.com to see any of our kind of further news and information about any of our upcoming exhibitions. Thank you so much for kind of peering into our little society.